my stone and mine. Hi there. How are you doing? Did not expect to see you here. Shall we begin with this video? Okay, sounds like a good idea. Let's go to this place right here. This was one of the comments from the previous video. Albuquerque, New Mexico. And the person that left this comment, I have not heard from in quite some time. I remember seeing his comments a few times. Pork Sosa is his name. Smoking weed is his game. And that is not allowed on YouTube, so uh, some channels often get deleted when they do that sort of thing. Uh, anyway, here we are. So, Volkswagen Passat. Interesting. Here we have an Audi A4 Estate. And a Subaru Legacy. And a Nissan Patrol. And uh, a bunch of other cars that I'm not going to bother naming. So these pictures were taken in 2019. Oh yeah, by the way, somebody, a couple of people said something about Street View not being live. You, you, you don't say. You don't say! Why would Street View be live? Hmm? 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 Of course it's not live. I even replied to one of those comments saying that I often forget that some people think I'm serious in my videos. So, now that I've addressed the special people in the audience, let's get back to this. Right then, in which direction should I head? Let's have a look and see. So, that direction right there seems as though it's going out of town. Whereas this is going in and that is also going in let's head that way seems like a very beige place new mexico bank and trust that's funny because i never trust banks now one place i'd like to visit is mexico because one it's uh, i think it's a warm place i'm looking at these trees there's no leaves what time of year is this not too sure all right, so this is the temperature there right now, and it's quite warm. So this is Celsius, and in Fahrenheit, it is 68. So 29 degrees C on Saturday, which is pretty warm, I'd say. 31 degrees on Friday next week sometime. And this right here is the climate. So right now we're in May, and uh, it's going to reach about 34 degrees on average. I'm guessing these are averages. That is the conclusion I came to in the previous video. Interesting arrangement of colours on this fence. Don't see that often. What are these parking meters? I haven't seen a parking meter in a long time. Not these types anyway. Usually there's just one and it's a digital one and you've got to walk to it and then go back to your car and stick a little sticker in the window. What is that artwork right there? That's interesting. What's that about? Is that still part of the bank? Wonder who chose to put that there. I really wasn't expecting this level of uh, buildings. Is that, did that even make sense? When I picture Mexico, I think desert, cactuses, cacti. The buildings, I mean, this sort of fits the image, like flat tops and um, that sort of thing, but seems fairly modern to me. I mean, especially judging by these types of buildings right here. But then again, we are in the city, so let's, um, let's go over this bridge. Let's have a look at the graffiti. So it's not graffiti, it's just artwork on the side of the building. Well, technically that's what graffiti is, but um, this is legal graffiti. And I can see it's gotten a little cloudy looking. He's not a live video. We seem to have a bit of an issue. I can't see to go more than one step at a time. And uh, I can't go down there. Let's zoom out a little bit. And now I'll place this guy there. All right, that worked. Now let's see if I can go more than one step at a time. Oh, man. This is going to be a pain in the balls. Okay, so you see this building right here. I was expecting to see quite a lot of these in Mexico. Uh, that's what I thought would be all over the place. That style of building with a flat top. Let's maybe head down this street right here. Ooh, summertime. So far, I haven't seen a lot of people on the streets. That's a nice looking little house. Not too sure about the chain link fence, but uh, then again, the entire area probably has this sort of fence around it, around the houses around it, around everything around it. But yes, I would like to visit. Not too sure which area I would go to, but um, I would definitely, oh, there's a park back there, some sort of a um, play area for the children. Or um, whatever. Oh, there's a person there. I didn't even see that dude. Sat on a bench reading a book, a magazine or something. What's this guy got in the back of his pickup? He's got a tyre and another tyre. Interesting. Not really. Also, the houses vary quite a bit. Also, 
brick houses. Brick, that's wooden, but this is not. And right here we have a Golf GTI. And a Golf over here. Mark a two Golf GTI. I am also drinking a can of Pepsi, which is very nice. It's weird how Diet Pepsi is sweeter than Diet Coke. Look at the wheels on that. Does that, is that, wait a minute. Which one of these is the house? Is, I think this is the house that this dude lives in. Unless they're both part of the same property. I mean, if they're not, they're quite close together. And on the other side, we have these. Are these like one bedroom apartments or something? I wonder if we can take a look inside this. Wait a minute, these were taken in 2014. Do any of these have blue dots? No, they don't. What is that? Shockwave defense. What is that about? Ah, oh, maybe it's some sort of a martial arts building. That's what it seems to look like to me. Wait a minute, we have a blue dot right there. Got to see what that is. Wonder what it could be. Hmm. Dude. Ah, is it a studio, maybe? No, maybe that's just a place where the band plays music for whatever goes on in here. Let's have a look at the front of the building and see what it is. And it is... Appears to be as though it's some sort of a hall in which stuff takes place. So, yeah. Meh. Look at this dude. Should be helping his friend. Zoomed back out. Let's see which other area we can have a look at. Let's maybe just go over here then. What's that about? That's a pretty big building. Is that one building? All right, so that is... Wait, what is that? Oh, self-storage. Right, that makes sense then. Ah, right, I see, yeah. That makes sense now, yes, okay. Let's zoom back out. Now that makes sense, wow, look at all those, that is insane. Let's have a look at this street right here. Seems like a nice area. As you can see, there's no grass. Interesting. There's quite a lot of these trucks around, lifted trucks. Never had a lifted truck before, but I wouldn't say no to one. And what is this guy doing? Ah, he's doing some weeding. Yep, I'll leave him to it. And you see that right there, that is what I expected a lot of in this area. Just a lot of desert. A lot of nothing, a lot of just this. That is the first flag that I've seen. Uh, it seems like this area is full of newly built houses. So you go here, if you're interested in one of these houses. So whoever's running this place has put that there. I'm kind of glad that I don't have to go one at a time like this. That would be so annoying. Instead, what I can do is just go like this. Ooh, what is that? Oh, wait a minute. Irox Z. Z. Irox Z. And here we have a Honda with a big old fart pipe on it. I used to know somebody that drove one of these. He drove it into somebody's garden, basically destroyed it. Luckily, I wasn't inside it, but I did go to see him and his entire family turned up. Basically, what he'd done was, wait a minute, 116,000. Can't quite see that, but 116490. Anyway, he was driving down a street and for some reason he handbraked it and ended up in somebody's garden. That was the end of that car. I think he might have replaced it for another one that was quite similar to it. All right, so we're in a slightly different area now. I like the style of these houses. Now, the rain can sort of lead to a few issues on flat tops, but other than that, uh, well, actually, I don't think it really rains that much around here, does it? Not too sure. Anyway, zoom back out and we'll see where else we can go. Okay, so down here by the, um, what I'm guessing are maybe mountains or just hilly areas. Start off over here. Ooh, nice and green. That's a nice house. Wouldn't mind something like this myself. Well, let's head up this street. What is that, a Jeep? Not sure what it is, but it's got some chunky tires on it. Wait a minute, is that a Mustang? That looks like a Mustang with a flat tire. It is a Mustang with two flat tires. Probably four flat tires, to be honest. Nice. Paintwork seems a little faded. I wonder when these pictures were taken. What is that, 2014? So that's probably not there now. I mean, then again, it might be. It'll be in worse condition, but you could maybe give the guy an offer for it. I don't know how much you'd offer for it, but resto mod. 
you could restore it. Let's have a look at this guy's garden. What has he got? He's got a barbecue grill right there. Nice. And a bunch of flowers and stuff. Nothing much going on. Ah, a jacuzzi. Nice. They look like chess pieces. And that right there is a Nissan 300Z. I had one of these. One of, I, mine was like this. That looks like a Mazda MX-5 or a Miata. Is it a Miata, you guys call them? Not too sure. But also a bit like a Dodge Viper, if you squint your eyes a little bit. I've got two watches in this room. One of them on my wrist is about to beep again. And I've been doing this for an hour now. And still, I have no content. What we'll do is we'll head up to this area right here and we'll see what this is about. All right, so this is where you park your cars and you can walk your dogs. So we have snow right there, but this person is in a t-shirt. What is that? Is that a Jaguar? Jaguar. It is. XJ. There's an old Mercedes. Some of these houses aren't that bad, to be honest. Wow, look at the number on that. 13908. Actually, you know what I think it is? I think it's too many Tarantino movies. Sort of got me thinking houses are like this in Mexico. And, well, they are, some of them. Just not all of them. Ah, and then we've got another flag. Another flag. Actually, I'm kind of surprised this isn't a Mexican flag. White Cloud Street. Antelope Dancer. Oh, another Mustang. If you're interested in a Mustang, a resto mod. It's a little rusty looking, but I'm pretty sure you can sort that out. We'll go over to... Let's check out this area. Ah, oh, golf course. Nice. Let's start off in this corner. Nice house. Not too sure about living right on the edge, though. That could be a little iffy. Zoom out a bit, and uh, let's have a look at this house with the pool. Hmm. Nothing really too special from the front. Got quite a few of these around as well. VW Beetles is what they're called where I am. And if they're not called that where you are, they're probably called a bug. Alright, we seem to be getting a little lower down in the hills, and there seems to be a little more vegetation in the gardens. So we've got grass, and everything's a little more greener. Interesting design, I wonder if he designed it himself. And here we have another American flag. Wonder why they are not Mexican flags. We are in Mexico, right? Ah, but it's part of USA. So if there was a Mexican flag, it would be because the owner is Mexican. Not sure. Let's just change the subject. Let's keep going. Let's just keep moving. And this guy right here likes his BMWs. Wow. Time just flies sometimes. Actually, I did stop for about half an hour. Well, that is a wall just there by itself. Is that somebody's driveway? Is that the entrance to somebody's driveway? Well, let me zoom out and have a look. Alright, so it starts there. That means... Ah! It just might be. Yeah, that could be the entrance to somebody's driveway. I never... never even, blah, blah, blah. If it wasn't for going to Greenville, I would never have realised that was the driveway to somebody's house. Or, like, this building there. So, learn something new. Alright, so this street is a little closer together. Nice looking neighbourhood. These houses seem to look more sort of similar to each other though. Ah, check these out though, on the hill. I'd, have, I'd probably have to get one on the hill. Hopefully there's not a lot of earthquakes if I do get one on the hill. I only experienced one earthquake ever and that was pretty cool actually to be honest. Alright, so I think we're going to leave this place now. Shall we take a quick random street drop? Let's just drop down to about there somewhere. Two red cars next to each other. One thing's for sure, this sun really does eat through paintwork. Or maybe it's just the paintwork. Let's do another random drop. What does this guy have in his driveway and why? What? That looks like some sort of a trap. And this thing? What is this contraption? That would probably be connected to a horse and then like the rider would sit there. This though, a pretty much torture device, I think. Actually, maybe it's farming, something to do with farming. Well, this has been fun. Didn't expect this part of Mexico to look like this, but um, quite nice to be honest. Why do I always expect the worst? Not too sure. 
Either way, no matter what the situation is, expect the worst. That way, you're always pleasantly surprised. And I shall catch you in the next one. And how do I stop recording? Why have I forgotten how to stop? Oh, it's there.